are here are guests on Highway Radio discussing an issue, an issue that affects the community, an issue that affects the environment. They were discussing air pollution because it had affected the community. We heard about the 42 children that were admitted due to air pollution. That was a discussion. That is what the role of the media is, to look at issues affecting people's lives and issues affecting their environment. Very, very correct. The PM police, I should call, were very, very fast to arrest the people that were discussing issues affecting people's lives and the environment. Meanwhile, they left people that were preaching hate speech and tribalism, a clear indictment on the patriotic front government. It simply shows that those that were speaking were sponsored by the patriotic front, hence the fears to arrest them. But they were too quick to arrest people that were looking at issues affecting people's lives, affecting the environment. Is that fair? Now, we take it to say, aha, what happened at Iwell, my fellow colleagues, journalists, is exactly what Dora Casolo and the Patriotic Front government wants when they call for statutory regulation. That is an example of a statutory regulation. You are going to have what to say, what not to say. Whether it affects people's lives, whether it affects the environment, as long as they do not want you to say that, you will not have to say, they will arrest you. Clear indicator. That is the reason why, that is an example of statutory regulation by the patriotic front. To guard the media. So that you are not free to talk about issues that you feel you need to talk about. That is, a, that is the example. Now, is this what we want? They want people who can go and talk about tribalism. They want people who can go and preach hatred. Meanwhile, they are aware of what that cause in Rwanda, genocide. It started exactly as it was on Rotanda. Except we Zambians are very different people. Very different people. We are very sober. But even if we are sober, we should not be taken for granted. We should not be taken for granted. So what happened at Iowa, my, my, my fellow colleagues, journalists, is exactly what the PF wants to do with you, to guard you. You are going to be arrested. Our body are just intimidated. A camera can urinate in your mouth. A camera can be, can be grabbed. But the one that will formalize is that you do not complain. So that you do not report on what is wrong. But you just report on what is right according to them. So, as UPND, we are saying, we need to see that the two, Abraham Mulenga and the Samba, should be arrested. They should be arrested. You cannot only suspend a broadcasting license and leave those to spot free. You cannot do that. That is unfair. But that is the work of the patriotic front governments. A very bad government, a failed government. We are not going to accept that. We want to hear by evening today or by Monday tomorrow that those two have been arrested. Just like you arrested people, innocent people, that were talking about issues affecting their lives, affecting the environment. You arrest, you arrested the interviewer, the guest, including the station manager. Quickly, quickly, you jumped in. Is this a country, honestly? Is this a country we want to? Sometimes let us work up. Let us work up. 